Welcome to Life Journey. I'm your host, Theophilus McPherson. Listen, it's amazing that our younger generation living in a fantasy world. What is a fantasy world? You may ask. A fantasy world is a person that, that lives at home and they're living above their mean. What, what you mean? I mean that a person that 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 uh, making less than minimum wage, they got audacity to rent or to lease a car. Yes, you have the latest iPhone, you have the latest iPad, you have the latest computer, and you're living in a fantasy world because you're still living with your parents. I never understand. Where, where, where young adults can, can get the audacity not to listen to their parent. The parent will tell you to save for a rainy day. Rather than saving for a rainy day, you're going to keep on spending above your mean. And you're not living, you're living beneath your mean, but you're spending things that you ought to be saving up to. And I never can understand why we as a society especially the younger generation, the generation of X, they are living beneath their privilege. I never understand. The Bible say, remember in that creator in the days of that youth, when we say we have no pleasure in it. What the Bible is saying that, that when you're young, you ought to remember your creator. Remember the one that created you. Your money didn't create you. Your education didn't create you. Your mother and your daddy didn't create you. The, the person that created you was God. And I'm telling you, especially a younger generation, is number one, I mentioned that you got to love your mother. You got to love your father. Honor your father and mother that your days be long upon this earth. And for those that are bringing in children into this world, you bring the children this world without a daddy, without getting married, and being on welfare, being on public assistance, being on TANF, my friend. And we getting mad with the president of the United States of trying to cut down on welfare, cut down on public assistance. A lot of people are abusing the system. But still, a lot of people are living in a fantasy world. They're still saying the plane, the plane, and there really ain't no plane. So what I'm saying, I'm saying to you that if you're watching this video and you are still living with your parents, my friend, you ought to be saving because your parents are not getting younger, they're getting older. And you guess what? You can't you can't even go to the to to the to the to the uh, senior citizen home with your parents. So if you ain't saving no money up, you either gonna be homeless or you're gonna be in a shelter. Or you're gonna be you're gonna have a roommate and they're gonna be in a privacy, my friend. So I'm telling you to tell you this. If you are adult and you still live with your parents and you're not saving, you are living in a fantasy world. You're living in a world that is not real, even though you live in a world that's not real, but if you're not saving your money, but you live in funny, you are you having the latest iPhone. You, you are leasing a car. You 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 living above your mean and being on 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 a minimum wage. You living in a fantasy world and it's time for you to wake up and realize it's time for you to buckle down and be responsible. And for those that have not given their, 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 their parents a red dime, that means that you're not paying no utility, you're not giving no money for rent, you're not doing nothing but living above your mean. You living like a Jones and you're not even a Jones. You get the latest tennis shoes, you get the latest iPhone, you get the latest uh, 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 dress codes. Come on, you are living in a fantasy. Come on, let's face the fact. Half of y'all don't have a 
uh, uh, education meaning that you dropped out of school and expect to, to have a decent job. Listen, I'm saying the school is nothing, is not benefit you to get a good job now, but I'm saying you can be an inventor without going to school. But I'm just saying, half of y'all just don't read. Half of y'all can't read. The only thing y'all, y'all half y'all do is is get on the video games, play the video game all day long, and then expect things to fall in your lap. And you're living in the la la land. It's time to wake up as being civilization. It's time to wake up as being young adult. If you still live in your mother's house or your father's house, and you are 30 years old. And you're not paying no bill. You don't have a decent job. You don't have a full-time job, but you're leasing a car, and you have the latest iPhone, and can't pay the bill. You're living in a fantasy world, and it's time to face the fact that civilization gonna hit you, and you're gonna say, "What happened?" We gotta be the person that gonna make things happen, or wondering what happened. It's time for you to wake up and realize you got to get out of this fantasy and face the fact. The fact is you need to grow up. You can't expect your mom to keep on washing your dirty clothes. You can't expect your mom to keep on cooking your meal. And you're not putting nothing on the table, but you want mama and daddy to pamper you. You're being 30 years old. You live in a fantasy world, my friend. And it's time for you to face the fact. It's time for you to get out of fantasy and face the fact. The fact is, you're getting older, and your parents are getting older. Soon, lady, your mom going to be living, or your father going to be living in a senior citizen home, and you haven't even saved $500 in the bank. You're living from paycheck to paycheck, and you are halfway get ready to lose your job. What I'm saying to you, for the young girls that's out there that looking for a man to give them a child to, to get child support, you living beneath your privilege. If a man ain't giving you a ring rather than a condom, you live in a fantasy world because this man is not going to take care of the child. You're going you're to say, that's not my baby. And what's going to happen? You're going to end up on welfare. Come on, face the fact of civilization. If you looking for example, the example is your mother and father married, you ought to get married before you even lay down and have a baby by this knucklehead and got a good job. The parents are paying for almost everything and he got a dastardly want his last name on the birth certificate. And he came about no pamper. He came about no Similac. He came to pay for nothing that the baby have on. Fantasy, my friend. It's time to face the fact and get out of fantasy. Because fantasy can't pay the bill. As I mentioned before, romance and not having a finance is nonsense. Romance and no finance is nonsense. And a lot of people are living in the nonsense. They're living in a fantasy world. You living uh, 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 above your mean, and you can't even pay your you, you can't even pay your car your car note. You can't even pay your your phone bill. It's time to live. It's time to face the fact, my friend, and especially my young adults. It's time for them to face the fact. You can't live off a of mom for the rest of your life. You you about to be thirty years old. You're still living at home. Thirty years old and can't even can't even pay your your car note. You can't even pay your, your phone bill, but you have the latest iPhone. You have the latest uh, 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 watch, iPhone watch, and you don't have a place to put your son or your daughter in. Let's face the fact. You're living in a fantasy world, and it's time to face the fact. And the fact is, get a saving account. Spend reasonable. Put your money in investments. Save your money. Stop buying the latest. Stop trying to be like the Joneses. Stop living above your mean and you living in you having a, you having a, a minimum wage job. You're not even making twenty dollars an hour. You're just making eleven dollars an hour. 
and not even full time. And you're living above your mean. You're living in a fantasy world, my friend. And I must tell you that it's time for you to wake up and realize that you're a paycheck away from being put out. Because you have your mama and your daddy getting old. And soon later, they're going to ready to go to the nursing home, which I'm not going to the nursing home to think about it. Hey, glory to God. As long as I got health and strength in my body, I'm going to live, glory to God, where God want me to live. So what I'm saying, this video is to, to get off a fantasy and face the fact. If you are an adult and you got a living mother and father and you, not, you don't have a bank account, you are living in a la-la land. Because your parents is not going to take up with your knucklehead for a long time. So what I'm saying to you that's watching this video, if you are a young adult and you got a job, it's time for you to save your money and stop buying the latest tennis shoes, the, the latest jeans, the latest earrings, the latest tattoo on your body and can't pay your rent. Wake up and realize that it's time to face the fact and get off a of fantasy because fantasy can't pay the bills. Fantasy, fantasy can't pay your phone bill. Fantasy can't, can't put the food on your table. Fantasy can't buy a pamper for your child. Fantasy can't, can't even pay, pay Similac milk for your daughter or your son. What I'm saying to you that's watching this video, if you're a young adult, it's time for you to grow up and stop acting like a baby. You are an adult now. You're the age right now of accountability. You're the age now that you can make decisions on your own and start depending on your parents to make decisions for you. Wake up out of sleep and face reality. Face the fact of life. Face the fact and get off a of fantasy. Get off a la-la land. 